Hi everyone, I'm back with another Melting My Stash review. The first one that I want to talk about is Pink Cherries from Sweet Fixations. This is a really good scent. This is the first one that I've melted from my Sweet Fixation stash and I love it. I would definitely repurchase this one. I melted it here in the den in a tea light burner and I melted the entire tart. I got amazing scent throw here in the den and the scent flowed out of the den and into just outside of the den. Very nice. As I was walking into the den, I could smell a very sugary, sweet, fruity fragrance. Not sickingly sweet, just a really the perfect pink sugar blend. Um, those cherries came through the sweetness of the sugar pink sugar really um, sweetened out the cherries because sometimes cherries can have a tartness a slight tartness to them but this one was just sweet and fruity and I really enjoyed it um, I got several hours of scent throw but you know when you're melting uh, a tart from a tea light burner it won't last quite as long but that was fine by me because it was so wonderful while it was melting while it did last I really enjoyed it I didn't mind having to change it out but this is one that I would definitely repurchase I'd like to have more of this on hand the next one that I melted is Kinky Pink from Truly Yours. Now I melted this uh, a couple of times. I melted two cubes in a 24 watt warmer here in the den. I got a medium scent throw, but a good scent throw. This smells amazing. This is another really good pink sugar scent. You know, I never thought that pink sugar scents could really stand on their own. I always thought, oh, well, you've got to mix them. How wrong I was, and this this kind of proved that to me. Um, when I melted it in the 24-watt warmer, I was like, oh, okay, yeah, I smell it. It's nice, you know, nice scent. But I have one cube going now in a tea light burner in my dining room. Awesome. I can smell it here in the den. It's starting to flow into the kitchen area. It's perfect. This is it smells so good. When you open up this container, you just get that really good pink sugar scent. And you see mine, I broke it because I dropped it, but still it doesn't matter because it's going in the warmer. Um it's perfect. Again, I'm really impressed with this and you know, I think this might end up being my favorite from Truly Yours. Yes, I still have more to melt, but I love this one, and I will be repurchasing this one. Um, I Like I said, I'm getting a better scent throw, melting it in a tea light burner. Um, I can smell it right now while I'm sitting here doing this video. It's just amazing. Now I'm going to show you some of the tarts that I melted from Delightful Scents. I talked about Delightful Scents a little bit um, in the past. I showed the um, my coffee cup tea light burner and I was melting my Delightful Scents um, hazelnut coffee tart which is amazing. <laughs> and you know I've talked about Delightful Scents off and on. I've been melting their tarts throughout the spring and summer. I didn't I wanted to do a review um well in the summer but I decided not to because they were on vacation and closed their site and it to me I felt like well if I do a review of all of these scents and people want to order things they wouldn't be able to go through on their website so um I just kind of held on to the containers um, like I would normally do just so I can show you everything and now that they're open um, now I can talk about the scents now Delightful Scents has just redesigned their website um, and they have added some new scents to their list their scent list and of course I placed another order so I have a haul coming up 
and um, they have retired some of their scents like you know that's what vendors do they bring in new scents they kind of clearance out old scents and speaking of clearance they do have a clearance page on their website with um, a, a lot of good scents listed at a reduced price so you might want to check that out now this one is vanilla spice it's another one of my favorites from delightful scents this is the perfect vanilla meets just the right amount of cinnamon and nutmeg that's what I get in this blend a perfect vanilla um, a sweet creamy vanilla and then just the right amount of cinnamon and just a little touch of nutmeg it's not too spicy it's not overpowering and it's not sickening it's a really creamy soothing blend and it's great for any time of the year spring summer the fall it'll be great in the winter this is one that I want to have on hand all of the time and you know I'm not sure if I included this in my order but I would definitely be repurchasing it if I did not I can't remember right now if I added this to my order but um yeah I this is a really good one and it gives a really good scent throw Next from Delightful Scents, this is Love Spell, and I talked about this. This is, I believe, the first tart that I talked about from Delightful Scents. And I just included it here to show that I did finish it up. Um, it did not disappoint at all. It's an exact dupe of Victoria's Secret's Love Spell. Awesome. Um, it gives amazing scent throw, and it's so strong that you don't have to use the entire tart. You can actually cut this in half or cut it in quarters, and you will get an amazing scent throw. When I melted this, I used a 24 watt um, two-in-one candle warmer, the combo warmers, and awesome awesome I used it at home and I used it at the workplace and just a really nice scent also from delightful scents this is another vanilla scent um, their vanillas seem to be very good this is another vanilla scent that I really enjoy from delightful scents very vanilla and it, it was a very vanilla scent this one can melt on its own sometimes vanilla scents really don't show through you know they really don't um, they're not very potent they don't have they don't give off a strong throw but this one did and um, this can be melted on its own and this would also make a great mixer now what I did was I cut this tart in half I melted one half in my 24 watt warmer in my bedroom and then the other half I ended up using it later as a mixer I blended it with a floral tart that I was melting that turns out that I didn't like it was way too strong and I needed to mellow it out and I always reach into my little storage drawers for a, a vanilla scent whenever something is way too strong it's just I don't know it's my go-to scent and this one really did the job it mellowed it out um, toned it down and just made it bearable because sometimes I really can't tolerate the strong floral scents but um, this one blended very nicely and then finally from delightful scents is heavenly now this is another Victoria's Secrets dupe I really like this one it's not quite as strong as um, love spell um, the love spell dupe it is it's more delicate it's a more delicate scent and I really like it and actually I had never smelled heavenly um, from Victoria's Secrets line but after I melted this I went to Victoria's Secrets and I smelled the perfume and I really like it in fact I want to get it now because I, I'm really impressed with the scent um, I tend to like more intense really deep deeply um, 
and richly scented perfumes but I also like this one there is something slightly intense about it however it is a very delicate scent but the notes um, uh, it has some really interesting notes to it so this I enjoy I pop the entire tart <laughs> in the 24 watt warmer in my bedroom and it filled up the bedroom with a nice delicate perfume fragrance Okay, well, I got through all of those tarts, so I guess I can quickly show you a candle that I am melting right now, and then I can wrap this video up. This is one of my candles that I purchased from Kay's Creations, and let's see if I can get zoom in. It's in absinthe absinthe <laughs> and um, I'm gonna pick up my camera and show you this is such a beautiful candle it's a two wick candle it's burning beautifully this is the fourth time this week that I have burned this candle it's a wonderful scent it kind of reminds me of a spiced gumdrop but just slightly different um, it's not meant to be a sinus relief. However, um, being that I was a little sick over the past weekend and I was melting a lot of my sinus relief tarts, my Vicks vapor type tarts and all of that, I was kind of tired of those. Um, and I really didn't want that strong medicinal scent throughout the week. So I reached for this one because I really like the notes in this one. They are kind of spicy and I find them to be a bit invigorating and they kind of penetrate my nostrils, you know. So um, I reached for this one and awesome scent and giving off an awesome throw. Um, mixing nicely with the, uh, the other tart that I have going in... Um, in the uh, dining room this one I can still smell it so these two are kind of blending in together and mixing nicely um yeah so I just wanted to show you guys that this is a uh, K's creations candle and um, so yeah I hope everyone is doing well I hope you like this video um, I hope you saw something that you liked and I will provide links to all of the vendors that I um, talked about in this video okay everyone well uh take care and i've got some more um review videos coming up a couple of haul videos coming up and i will be announcing my contest very soon bye